two-time world match play champion Rod Harrington, former number one in the world uh, in Holland. How are you enjoying Holland so far? Yeah, I've always enjoyed Holland. There's always been a big contingency of uh, dart players over here, you know, especially when Raymond Barnvelt won the, the World Championships there at Lakeside many years ago. Um, so we've, we've seen a little bit of decline in, in Holland over the last two or three years. So what we're trying to do, we're trying to revitalise it here uh, with the senior pros and with the um, youth tour coming over here now. You're a director with the PDC now. Um, one of your main concerns is the PDC Unicorn Youth Tour. Uh, how is it going so far in the first year? It's absolutely going brilliant. Uh, when I first proposed it three years ago to the, the board and Barry Hearn, uh, there was things going on at the time like us uh, suggesting that we buy the BDO out to try and revitalise the darts worldwide, which didn't come off. So it got put on the back shelf a bit. So at the beginning of last year, I went to the board and, and bullied them a little bit into saying, look, this is what I want to do. And, and Mr Hearn and the board know that if, I'm, if I do things at darts, I come from an area of where it, it possibly is the right thing because I'm an ex-professional. I don't look after anyone, so I come from the middle of the road. And uh, they actually said to me, how many players do you think you'll have? And I said, well, if I get 32, I'll be over the moon. Uh, and we started to get over 100 in Britain, which was absolutely unbelievable. It was up to 140 on one of the events. And we're still averaging over 80, which is unbelievable. Uh, and, of course, um, now we've moved to Austria and, and here in Holland. And uh, we had 51 yesterday. Um, and there's some lovely young talent here. I mean, Gino Voss made the final yesterday. Um, some great players. They just need nurturing in the right place. And the youth tour is the right place to bring them. Um, next year, I'm hoping to uh, have weekends of darts, not just one tagged on the back of uh, professional tours, but have a weekend of darts if the board can agree to it, if I can get the money off of them and the Players Association and a couple of other sponsors like Unicorn. Um, then I'll run two on a Saturday, one on a Sunday, and have like a festival of darts for the youth. Uh, not only in Britain, but here in Holland and in Austria and Germany. Uh, I've had a meeting with the Italians today. So, you know, it is out there. And uh, by bringing in the youth, uh, that's the future of the game. Uh, and if we don't have a future, then we don't have a game. You're very into the youth. We can hear it when you're saying it. You talk with real passion about it. You've been here yesterday for the youth tour um, in Holland. Have you seen much talent in the Dutch kids? Oh, yeah, as I said, Gino Voss uh, is exceptional. Uh, good throw, good stance. That's what I like about a lot of the players. They watch the good pros and they take pointers from them. Um, you know, obviously Van Gerwen, we all know about Michael Van Gerwen. I watched him six, seven years ago out in, uh, in Holland and thought he would be the next Phil Taylor. He's just gone off the ball a little bit. Um, but there are an awful lot, to just name one or two would be impossible. I mean, my son plays on the youth tour and he lost to a guy called Tim um, that threw as quick as Yelly Klassen. Um, which is a bit erratic, I, you know, as a perfectionist in darts, I would tell him to slow down a little bit at times. But there are so much talent, and what we need to do is give them a stepping stone from there to the professional tour. It's unfair to just chuck these youngsters into the pro tour because these pros are senior pros. They don't give anything up. You're not going to beat them unless you're playing really well. So we need the experience trip, the learning curve, and the youth tour I see as that yeah, learning curve and their apprenticeship in the game of darts. All right, Rob, thank you very much. And we'll see you back in September for the youth tour. You certainly will. Thank you.